Yo, what's up guys, it's BJ Customs, and we're back with another video on this channel. And today we're gonna be doing an interview slash review slash shout out to Charles Tate here. He is OTS Cypher, correct? Yes, yes bro. Yes. And we are going to talk about what he does, his music and all that, where you can find it, all that good stuff. So if you enjoy some awesome music and you wanna to listen to this, make sure you stay tuned because we're gonna be talking about it, how we came to be doing it, all that. Let's go. Alright man, so I know the first thing these guys are gonna wanna hear is why you start making some music and what just inspired you. Uh well when I was like I think I started getting in like the first I mean like basically when I can understand like the English language kind of Yeah. <laughs> like I was like You uh, just enjoyed I music. Three, I did yeah. and also like my at least so I lived in Cleveland for a while and my uncle actually owns a record label, but I mean I don't really wanna work with like family because I wanna I wanna work for it. I don't wanna mm -hmm. be like, hey, you know, we should give me a record. No, I want to be able to like, like work. work yeah, but that's like, awesome. And like, um, when I was really young, I didn't had no idea what was going on, but I actually had an uncle who was like a recording artist, and I had the uncle who owned a recording label. And there was a studio in my basement, but I had no idea what it was, but I went in there and I just heard like amazing, like just kind of like a rhyme scheme, and like I didn't mm -hmm. know what it was, but I was like, this is awesome. And at that point, I wasn't like, oh, I wasn't like three, and I wasn't like, oh, I'm gonna rap. No, I didn't even know. Um, I actually like this all started from um kind of like this started from like a rap battle actually yeah and I was like I think I could start making music I think that's pretty cool and I actually really didn't know what I wanted to do with my life because I was just kind of like I'm not I'm not very good at like anything academically like really not really I mean yeah I'm, I'm good enough to pass like <laughs> definitely there's like there's obviously some things like, we yeah I really have kind of like I do a lot of business stuff, but that's not even academics. That's just that's just kind life of, yeah. type of stuff. Yeah, it's not even related to school very much. And so then, I see what you're saying. Yeah, and then uh, kind of like a lot of uh, things went on. Like I mean, like when I first made my first song, it got a lot of hate. <laughs> like, I because I never heard your first song, mm -hmm. but I heard people talk about it, and they said like they said it wasn't the greatest song I ever heard, and it was like didn't you get into like a a diss. I got into a diss with uh, Avery Modern. Yeah, because um, and I'm really that's like, where I first I was like, you make some music. That's when I first yeah. found out you actually made yeah, your raps. I, yeah, that wasn't like my first. That was like a couple songs in. Mm -hmm. And back then, I wouldn't say I'm like like you know super good right now, but I'm, I'm, I'm better than. It's uh, like me watching good YouTubers and then me watching my old videos. I'm definitely not <laughs> that, but I'm not. Like you're like yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm in the middle somewhere. And like so I know what you're saying. Yeah, and all that like and then like I when I watched your. Um, like a couple, actually a couple days before we did this, I watched a bunch of your videos. And yeah, I, was like, I can like the editing got way better. Mm -hmm, like definitely, editing. like it's, I made a video about the uh, like for my one year on YouTube. I did like I watched my old videos and oh, it's nice. it was just terrible. Like my girlfriend and I, we always go back and watch <laughs> the old videos. Is and, she like? Well, what she did she rep your gear too? Did she? Yeah, rep, really. She has three shirts now. Oh my god, maybe four. That's pretty cool. Yeah, and we, we've only been together for like five months, like only five months, but <laughs> like with the gear and stuff, like I don't know, like what's gonna. I mean, like, um, I dropped new songs kind of like because like during the summer, I was going through a lot. Like my friends, when I first mm -hmm. started, they were like, "You should just stop." Like, no, like, I am, don't. Yeah, do, yeah, like you should not do uh -huh. this at all. And I think everybody goes through that when they have like a dream they want to do. And, and it's just the beginning. Well, it's how you gotta start, man. Yeah, and I I almost gave up. I was almost like, yeah, I'm not doing this, and um. So, but I didn't. I just kind of. I spent the summer writing. I spent the summer listening to people and visiting places and meeting people. Mm -hmm. And then, as soon as school started, I was like, just kind of like, yep, all right, dropping a bunch of like. I was like, yeah, time to yeah. blow up. Yeah. And so, I mean, I'm still not at that stage where I'm really blowing up right now. But we're like at, at this trend. Like this you're, you're just working on improving your music. Yeah. And, and I'm sure we can really yeah get you out there with some of these videos. Yeah. And, and then like. Just kind of, and then like that's why when you asked me that like, I want to do, I was like yes, yeah. Like, and um, the, especially this week, like with the gear coming out. Like, oh yeah, the, that's like, awesome. It's been, like going way. It, that's exactly what it does. Yeah. Like it took me a while. Like I got my shirts last Christmas, mm -hmm. and in like March or April, oh, 
that's when my YouTube just went, it jumped. That's when the <laughs> gear just jumped and everything has been going crazy. I think it's since then. You give people like a tangible, like kind of sense that I'm doing something. Mm -hmm. Like you give it to them like tangibly, like they're like, oh, this is pretty dope. Yeah. I'm gonna tell my friends to buy this. <laughs> like, And they see B. Terry, like I would go ask kids from all the, like I, when I go to Arts Immersion, I'd ask kids from all over. Mm -hmm. When I was doing the mannequin challenge thing, I was like, do you know B-Terry Customs? This is what it's for. I'm like, oh yeah, I know B-Terry Customs, but I never talked to these kids in my life. Yeah. And it's just how it is. And like, right, I'm definitely not at that level yet. I mean, like, I was, and you're a subscriber, oh my goodness. All right? When you hit a thousand, I was like, and it's mm -hmm. not even like, I know that like, some YouTubers I know that have like more than a thousand, but it's like, it's not like the number. A thousand. It's the fact that a thousand? That doesn't mean like a thousand views for each video. That means like you got like 17K for like each video just on views. I mean, there's one video with 150K yeah. and there's obviously tons that don't do very well, but there's many that do great. Yes, they and do. Then, like, I Google searched, um, I Google searched how to clean my sneakers. You're like one of the first I to know. come up on there. And I was like- that, That's awesome. Like, especially and, like, especially like, I remember, um, Going back, thinking about that, like, I looked at, like, kids my age, like, like you doing mm -hmm. things that you love, and it was, like, your dream, and I'm like, I'm not gonna give this up just because I'm gonna hate right now, oh, yeah. and, like, I mean, anybody watching this really, like, I mean, you should never, if you, no. if it, I don't matter, it doesn't matter how crazy it is, like, you should, like, keep doing it, even if. Never give up, just because no. it took me three months to get my first hundred subscribers. And I was getting no views then. I was barely getting 100 views on any videos. And then I started making my one Galaxy Rose customization, how to clean white shoes, that video that got 150K views. And then in like March, after I got like 300 subs, it started getting bigger from there. And I'm in a low time right now where I'm not getting as many subs and views, but I think it's just because I went during, like when school hit, I hadn't made as many videos and now I'm putting out videos more consistently and I had a couple setbacks like I couldn't yeah. talk because I had surgery in my mouth and so that always yeah or makes it hard but yeah don't ever give up just because it does take a while at the beginning but a lot of people at Meadville didn't respect what I was doing on YouTube until I got like 500 subs or a thousand subs or even I was dropping insane B-Terry custom shirts and stuff like that yeah so and I would be honest man I mean like and it's sad because like it's like I, I I've never received hate from like anybody in a lower like class like of 2016 through uh, mm -hmm. the rest of them. my class of 2017. That's where all the hate was. That's where like I was like mm -hmm. it's, it's sad to say, but I, I got to keep it true. That was where the most shade was thrown. Like, and I remember when my song went up on Twitter and um, it was gonna be played throughout the school and. So many people were uh, like, not so many people were like, yeah, let's play. But there, you know, there's always gonna be a two or three. I'm not gonna name names though. I'm not, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> not gonna put people on blast. But um, it's just kind of like, I mean, we're in high school for yeah. four years, and you're gonna, I put up three fingers for four years, and you're gonna tell, like, you're gonna tell me that just because something's crazy, you're not gonna pursue it. I mean, we're so young right now that you can't even, you can't make mistakes. I was looking like. When I started YouTubing last year, I had my customizations going since like eighth grade, but last year, my freshman year, when I started YouTubing, I looked at it as like, I saw these YouTubers got 300,000 subs in four years. So by the end of my high school career, I could be yeah. making like 100K a year just from YouTube. And that'd be awesome to go into college and have like a nice car. Yeah, and honestly, like you could be like, I mean, even at the end of this year, you could make like yeah. up to 8,000 subscribers. I know it's crazy, that's crazy. It, no, but, but you, you can hit happen. one of those jumps and you just make tons of great videos exactly. and it just happens. And it's like, it's just a, it's like, why well, are you gonna keep doing it? Are you gonna put in the work? But like, of course you, I've seen, like you, you're definitely mm -hmm. gonna do it. And um, it's kind of, there's a, like a lot of cool stuff coming up pretty soon. That like, uh, like there's a concert December, and uh, there's a bunch of other stuff. Like there's a lot that goes into like the music. Yeah. So you said your shirts are definitely selling. Oh yeah. They're selling. That's... They're selling. They're, they're, um, I've I've been working on the long sleeves. Mm -hmm. and actually, it's funny. Before I came here, I was actually picking up supplies for them. Yeah. That's why I was like, oh, I like text you. I was like, I'll be there soon. Mm -hmm. but, yeah, and those are uh, doing pretty well. So we talked before, and your short sleeves are gonna be nine. They are nine dollars right now. What yeah. colors can you get those in? You can get them in. Right now, you can get them in pink. You can get them in black and white. And I'm working on gray, but it's looking like. All right, that's a. 
That's a wandering Jacobs for just dropping it this week. And contact you, your Instagram, what's your Instagram, your Twitter, oh, yeah. anything. Just shout that out. I'll put it on the screen. Oh, yeah. That's, uh, it's at mm-hmm. OTS Cypher fan page on Instagram. And uh, my personal uh, Instagram is Charles underscore K12. Um, and then my SoundCloud, that, like, the link is definitely like, confusing. The link will be yeah. in, the be in the description below. Yeah, yeah. you know. <laughs> Actually, I'm wrapping the B Terry shirt for the. And uh, I saw that. I got my Cypher shirt on. <laughs> Right here? Yep. Who's hiding it? Watch out for um, the tape is dropping like, I'm thinking before the end of this month. Like, it's, it's so right now. if you guys definitely want to hear more of all the music he drops, as I said, SoundCloud link will be down <laughs> below and you guys can go check out that page he has on there because it'll show up. You'll see all of his tracks. You can click view all tracks when you get to his page because it's weird. You can follow it. It'll send you notifications of whenever he drops a new track, and you guys want to hear that. Uh, I dropped a track two nights ago. It was two nights, two, yeah, yeah. two or three, yeah. but it wasn't that long ago. It was this week. It was a new track. I enjoyed it. I definitely liked it. So you can take it from B Terry Customs that it was a good song, and you guys should go listen to it. Yeah. Once again, it's linked down below. I gotta talk about the inspiration. Just go. Uh, Just inspirations go. definitely um, is gonna sound like super like oh, he's not even a rapper. What are you talking about? But um, Patrick Stump was like one of my fir- like the first people I listened to, and like like his voice like impressed me. Mm-hmm. Like, music didn't really start impressing me until um, like I mean like putting it in your buds or something. Whoa. Like yeah. um, music didn't really give me like goosebumps until I was like maybe like in fifth grade. But I knew what it was. It was just kind of like wasn't like I was like a oh, cool song. But when I used to listen to a lot of Fall Out Boy, like a lot. Like mm-hmm. I used to be in the rock and roll and hardcore, and I still am. But um, huge, huge inspirations are like Logic, G Easy. Oh yeah. Um, Mint Condition is like this old group, a really, really old group. And um, definitely, uh, I have to say, Frankie Valley is one of my like favorites. Definitely. Oh, I don't like it. because of lyrics. I really do not sleep a lot. I don't like. Um, and at the same time, though, it's not really like, oh, I don't sleep, I'm so stressed out. It's like, mm-hmm. I sleep after I've accomplished what I can do. Mm-hmm. And it's like uploading a video for the night. Yeah. You just finish that and then you get to bed, yeah. Yeah, and then, like, I mean, like, in the list is crazy. Like, I can show you, like, right now, like, it's got, I mean, I have, like, a leather bound book with all my lyrics. Mm-hmm. But, uh, like, the whole vault with all my lyrics. And then this is just a um, one of my phone. It's crazy. That is crazy. It's huge. No, I'm not gonna like, give up like a lot. Cause, like, it's like there's like yeah, there's, there's, some, there's, stuff there's some stuff in the works stuff. that is gonna be amazing when it comes out. But you guys don't want to know about that just yet. They can know that it's coming. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's definitely coming very yeah. very soon. And um, oh yeah, um, I got to shout out Goober and Medeo for uploading my music video the other day. Definitely, that'll be linked down below as well. Definitely, um, anybody watching, please subscribe. That's this is a good channel. Really good Thank show. you, bro. Yeah, and I appreciate def- I appreciate the interview a lot. Yeah, it's no problem, bro. I really enjoyed the music in my first like we've been talking about. Yeah, we've been talking. We've been talking about, talking about a lot. Of, yeah, for a while. But after I heard these last couple of songs, I was like, we gotta make a video. Yeah. And so we're making a video. That was like the the songs before these songs like really weren't like. Uh, like uh, but it was now like, we hear these songs. It's like it's like yeah. I mean, I'm not gonna say like oh I'm the best like because I I definitely. Mm-hmm. Like, I hear, but there's yeah. there's some videos. It's like the same thing with me. Like there's some videos I know that I'm like, this is a great video. I yeah. worked on it hard, and it's a good video, and people are gonna enjoy watching it. Expect uh, in a couple days another single before the whole tape drops. Especially to the mass shooting body. I'm just trying to get everybody involved. Like, mm-hmm. like I'm trying to like. My goal was to see a B Terry custom shirt every day oh, of yeah. the year. I see one every day of the year. Thank you. Probably <laughs> do. There's a lot of them. Yeah. There's a lot of them. I saw a lot of those. That's crazy. I'm. Um, Definitely one of my goals is like, and this is crazy, but like, mm-hmm. I mean, like, I, yeah, you think it's my goal. I want to get thousand dollars a year off YouTube. There's a goal for I you. like, I want to honestly, like, before I'm 26, I want a gold record. Before I'm 26, there you go. And I'm 18 right now, so that's not a lot of time. You got plenty of time, right? and I definitely like, I mean, like, it's not all about money when I make, like, when I make music. It's definitely not because I'm not making any money off of music. I'm making money off of gear, but I'm putting it into my music so I can mm-hmm. make it sound better for my fans. But um, at the end of the day, um, I really just want to be able to give back to the people who actually like gave me a chance. We're like, well, yeah. hey, I like what he's doing. Uh, I'm gonna help him out. So like, if this ever did blow up, which I'm working on, like 
like wait on me. Um, definitely, I'm giving back. Um, probably gonna give my man's B Terry a shout out every time I play a show. Every, and like, I'm working on going on tour, definitely playing venues, and definitely playing a lot of shows. And if you like want to get in contact with me, and my contact information will be like in the description video. or something. You can go to his Instagram. You guys will be able to contact yeah. him because it'll be around. Oh, okay. You'll be able to. If I'm not nice now, I'm gonna work until I am nice. Like, exactly. Any B Terry fans that have been watching this for a while know that there were some terrible videos about a year ago, but we're a lot better now. We're still not where we want to be, but it's getting a lot better. Like I really couldn't talk and look at the camera. Contact information is down below, as well as my social medias, his social medias, mm -hmm. all of that, SoundCloud, everything. And we want to thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you go enjoy his music he's been producing, because we've both been working really hard, and we worked really hard in this video. So you should go listen to that music and give this video a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel. And you have a YouTube channel where I, you yeah, upload. Yeah, it's in the works. I'm, I'm trying to, like, it's, it's up there, but like, my videos are kind of like. Mm -hmm. it's, so we might link that down below. Mm -hmm. We probably will. There's yeah. going to be a lot of links down below in this video, just so you guys know that. You're going to want to go look at them just to, if you don't like all of them, pick one. Because there'll be one or two good ones I know all of you will like. Yeah. All we have for you today on Beach Air Customs. Thank you for watching once again. Hope you guys have a great day and enjoy watching BTR customers tomorrow. We're out. Later. Peace. Uh -huh. Yeah. Say I want it, what I mean is that I got it, huh? I'm on every track and every wave, I swear I'm neat, huh? Haters on my